so I sized it 1800 by 900 pixels and now I am looking for a background I decided to do diamonds for my background since I have a jewelry business and most of my jewelry is very blingy and you want to make sure you're looking up diamonds and elements so that you can find a backdrop and I'm just scrolling looking to see which backdrop I like the most and then I picked a backdrop and I set my image as background and I cropped it so that more of the diamonds could show now I'm going to elements and I'm going to look for the square I'm going to make that square black and I'm going to cover the entire page with this the black um, square and then I'm going to set the opacity down so that it can give a like a faded effect of, to the diamonds because that's not going to be the main objects that I want to like highlight. Now I'm going back into elements and looking up a Polaroid because that's how I want my pictures to be set up. And I find the one that I want and I'm going to duplicate it because I want two of those. And then I'm just going to kind of mess around with them until I get them to where I want them to be. Now I'm going in and I'm going to add some text on the right side and this is going to be my welcome banner so i'm just going to put welcome to and then i'm going to put my logo in the middle and then i'm going to put like my slogan for my business which is made for you with love and then i'm going to put a shop button at the bottom of that and i'm just going to let y'all look to see how I do it I'm really just playing with everything like the size and everything to um, see what looks best together and you'll see me move um, stuff around as I need to to go to my uploads and I'm just going to put the images in that I want to be in the Polaroid films and you have to crop the pictures and tilt them how the um, Polaroid is tilted so that it can look seamless and look like like it's actually a Polaroid picture.
so now I'm back at elements I'm going to click the box again and I'm going to make it a text box so that I can put um, shop now or shop all I want to put something along those lines and I'm going to make it like a box so like when your customers see it they can click on it and it can act as a button and I'm going to show y'all how to set it up in Shopify so that you'll be able to click it and it takes you to your products. Shopify you want to select gallery and then select image and then you want to it's just a add a picture in there and then you're just going to upload your picture right here and add it to there but I already have the picture added so I'm not going to re-upload it and add it but I'm just showing you guys how it looks and then where it says image link you're going to link all your products there and that'll make it to where it's a button and you should be able to click it so that you can see all of your products. <laughs> 